right now. From Milwaukee, this is today's TMJ4, live at 10. Thanks for joining us. We are following several developing stories tonight, but we begin at Marquette, where power went out in several buildings for the second time in the past couple of days. Lauren Linder is live at the university with what we're learning tonight. Lauren. Katie, a spokesperson for We Energies tells me the outage had to do with a problem with one of the underground cables, but as you can see, the power is back up and running. Taking a walk through Marquette's campus at about 6 tonight, you found buildings in darkness contrasting with those lit up. Students got alerts that several buildings lost power on campus and police dispatch was down. It impacted three buildings in the area by 17th and Wisconsin for a couple hours, including dorms and the commons, the dining hall that offers food 24 7. Uh, when I was coming back uh, to the dorm, there were a few kids that were stuck in the elevators. I know that was an issue, but they got out. Well, as we drove up Wisconsin Avenue, I saw the, uh, uh, the flashing lights. I, I said there's some police activity outside my building. Vice President of Mission and Ministry Father Fred Zagone was heading back from dinner when he noticed his residence had no power, something he also experienced just a couple of days ago in a different campus building. Last Thursday during the Marquette game when the power went out, we didn't lose power here, but I was down at the Jesuit residence and uh, we lost power about with about five minutes left on the clock. That was the concern for many students. It's really inconvenient because I can't watch March Madness and the Michigan game's on and I need to know if my bracket's doing well. Well, all the students can be watching March Madness again with the power back on. We Energies tells me that the incident from Thursday only affected two buildings on campus and that that had to do with a different underground cable. They're still investigating both of the outages. Reporting live at Marquette, Lauren Linder, today's TMJ4.